Welcome, Dr. Mandel here with you. This program you're going to love. Why? Because if you love your skin and you want your face to stay healthy, as long as you can, as you age, then this is gonna be for you. We all understand that the wrinkle business, and we're talking about these serums and lotions and all these different things that we find inside those jars, they're promising us, the consumers, that we're going to keep our fine lines away, we're gonna keep our skin smooth forever, but guess what? Studies show that most of these particular advertisements, it's not true, it's impossible. So what can we do? Are we gonna spend our time and our hope on the outside or get more tuned in to what's going on within our inside? Now we look at collagen, collagen is found in the bones, in the tendons, the ligaments, but it's also found throughout our skin. And what happens is after the age of 25 or 30, each year collagen production is diminished more and more and more, leaving us with less collagen. Well, collagen is that substance that causes that plush, that thickened, nice, smooth texture of our skin. So as collagen continues to diminish, one day we wake up and we say, oh my gosh, these wrinkles, these fine lines, my skin is drooping. Well, what do I do? As we look at the model here, that one has a lot of elastin and collagen. Remember, elastin is what brings the skin back. It doesn't sag. And as you see, as we age, as we get less elastin and less collagen, then we start having more problems, more wrinkles with our skin. So this is a neurophysiological technique, meaning that we're working with neurological pathways from that area to the brain. That is called afferent bombardment. That afferent supply is gonna go back to the brain and from the brain, it's gonna send efferent, which is motor messages, back to those muscles. Now look at these facial muscles. There are a lot of them. So if we don't use it, we're going to lose it. Now, as we stimulate these muscles, we're going to increase blood supply as well as lymphatic changes. I bet you didn't know that there are hundreds of lymph nodes in the neck, face, and head region. The purpose of those lymph nodes is to bring those toxins that's sitting in that area into the lymphatic system so it can be flushed out of our body. When that lymphatic system or those lymph nodes become congested, that's when we start having more problems with production of collagen, which will directly affect your skin. So what makes this technique unique and different? It's tapping. Before we work the muscle, we're gonna wake it up. Think about this for a second. If you have someone that's sleeping nearby, someone in your family, a loved one, and you call them all the time, they don't wanna wake up, what do you do? You walk up to them, Get up, get up, they wake up. Well, that's what we're gonna do with our muscles because our muscles are always trying to sleep. We need to stimulate them and before we work them, we wanna get this afferent neurological bombardment going from that area to the brain to stimulate the entire nervous system. When you do this technique, you need to have a good emollient oil, something that's gonna glide. So there's a few of them that I recommend. Coconut oil is great. Argan oil, uh, jojoba oil, uh, olive oil, whatever oil that you like, maybe even avocado oil, those oils are excellent for the skin and that is a good lubricant that can allow your fingers to glide nice and easy. And all you need to do is put a little bit on your fingers or you can actually put a little bit on your face as well first and then you can do the whole entire technique at one time. Most important thing is before you do this technique, make sure please your hands are clean and your face is clean. We don't want to contaminate the face, we don't want to spread germs, or we do not want to have your face breaking out. So we'll do this technique very simple. We're just gonna start from the top of the head and work our way down to the collarbone. Before we do any type of work in the muscles, we're always gonna do tapping or tapotment. This tapotment causes that afferent bombardment to the brain that causes this neurophysiological change to help increase circulation as well as increase elastin and collagen.
That is our goal. So what we'll do is we'll come with these two fingers, these are our tapping fingers all the time, between our uh, eyebrows right here, and we're gonna start just light tapping, not hard, and we'll start from the middle, and we'll just work our way out. Come a little higher up, good. A little light tapping, and we'll work our way out. Just nice and gentle, not hard, but just stimulating the area and one more time, okay, until you get to the top of the head. Now, stop. Feel what's going on. Feel that sensation, feel that tingling. That is hyperemia, increased blood supply to the area, increased neurological supply to the area where you're getting that stimulation, that neurological stimulation, just by doing that little tapping. So after the tapping, we take these two fingers again, bring it between the eyebrows, and everything that we do when it comes to the muscles is circular motions. You're gonna start from the middle and circular motions, work your way out. Come back a little higher up, circular motions, this nice firm pressure, and work your way out. A little higher up, circular motions, and work your way out. Those circular motions are extremely important to help excel this circulation. The next section is gonna be around our eyes. Now realize that the skin under the eyes is very thin. It's not the same as other parts of our face. We don't wanna push hard on there, but we can still tap on it. So we're gonna go inside uh, where the nose is and just go light tapping, just together, just like this. Really, really light. Just go back and forth a few times, okay? Very, very light, good. And you'll feel a sensation. Now what we'll do, you can use one finger since it's a small area, and you'll just lightly, as we did before, circular motions under the eyes, working its way out. And you can do that a couple of times. And then I want you to do, I want you to go above the eyes, okay, close your eyes, and just lightly, very lightly stimulate above the eyes, Okay, you feel right inside the eye socket, those areas right in there, because there's skin in there, really gentle, just a couple times, good. The next section is gonna be a little lower, right at the nasal area, our cheekbones here. We're gonna go ahead and start our tapping and work our way out, good, just like we did before. Okay, it's real simple, not hard. Okay, you're gonna keep going, just like I am right here. Good, all the way out. And the same thing again. We'll start inside, little circles, and work our way out towards our ears. Good, circular motions a little below as we go into the maxillary region. As we work it out towards our ears. Good, and we'll go a little bit lower. Okay, as we just stimulate it. Good, as we work it out toward our ears. You're doing great, we're almost done. So let's move down to the mandibular region. If you look here, there are many lymph nodes, particularly submandibular lymph nodes, as well as other lymph nodes, all around the bottom part of that jaw and the upper part of that neck. It starts getting very complicated. So this particular part is really important. What we'll do first is start uh, at the uh, jaw area, little tapping, come on. Let's just go ahead and tap, work our way up back and forth. Good, work our way back and forth. You can come a little bit underneath too. You can look up, just tap it and stimulate it. Good, and you'll feel that sensation. So we're gonna use these two fingers now. We're gonna grab underneath the mandibular area, the bone under here, one on the front side, one underneath, just like this, on both thumb and forefinger. And we're gonna start here and we're gonna just squeeze it as we keep squeezing as we go out to the jaw. As you come back in, keep squeezing it together. Good, and you're gonna do that about five or six times. Good. You're gonna go outwards and inwards. Outwards, keep squeezing, nice firm pressure. Okay, and come on back as we stimulate those lymph nodes, stimulate those muscles. Excellent. So now we need to stimulate this lymphatic area, and the best way and easiest way we can cover the most area is use the bottom part of your hand. You can take some of that oil, put it down in here in your hands, or put it up on the neck area. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna start right above the clavicle here, and we're gonna push in, and then we're gonna push in and up. Good, just kind of all around that area, in and up. In 
and up. And you can do that five, six, 10 times. So theoretically, you can spend 20 minutes working these muscles. But who has 20 minutes? The key thing with this technique is doing it consistently. Doing these little bits over time is really gonna help you increase that collagen production. Doing this first thing in the morning will definitely awaken you because those muscles have been sleeping for the last six to eight hours. If you decide to do it at night, I recommend it because it will reduce a lot of that spasm that you're having in the neck, clenching on your teeth, uh, having a tough day, carrying around a lot of stress with you, but this will help you sleep better because it's going to increase more circulation and allow you to relax easier. To keep our skin healthy, we need to make sure we increase that collagen. Our anthocyanidins, our blueberries, blackberries, cherries, raspberries, our fruits and vegetables, our greens. There are so many important foods we need to make sure we're getting and one of the most important vitamins is vitamin C. Also, make sure you're hydrating with lots of water. There's nothing more important than trying to help the body naturally. Feeding it the right nutrition, doing the right things and staying proactive. That's what's gonna help you live a happy life. I hope you found this video helpful. Please share it on your social media. Check me out, Motivational Doc on Facebook. Leave your comments below, please, because you're going to get a lot of responses. Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.